Good morning. Wow, it's so much brighter out. Uh, another beautiful day, episode 26, right? Um, yeah, my day off, so I'm doing this like two hours later. And <clears throat> 6 30 is sleeping in for me. Um, since I started. I don't think I've slept in past 6.30. I've got too much I want to do, you know. The thing is, is there's a lot of people out there. I mean, I haven't... Specific to me, not really. Yeah, it'll come. But, hey Oliver. Um, people's friends sometimes don't support as much as friends should. Um, and I'm not attacking anyone specific. I was uh, literally on um, on the road with Brandy yesterday, and we were talking, and uh, that's how the conversation got started. So, um, okay, so hater friends. <laughs> uh, for one, for friends on Facebook. Hey, Jacob. I would hope that friends should support one another um, and not hinder them at all. Because, okay, so, so for me, things have changed dramatically in the last month uh, or two because I started coaching so I, I picked up what my wife's already doing and she's becoming successful so I was like I need to get on this train because I'm gonna get left behind um, not that I wouldn't get success from her but why not us both do it and be successful uh, in a marriage you gotta be a, like a team so we just talk it out we figure out what we need to do um, we meet to talk about scheduling about our week when we can work in our workouts because this business is our priority okay so friends uh, hey Glenn so friends need to help friends need to support hey Connor um, they should always support one another um, I'm trying to, okay, I don't know, I'm trying to think of a good example of how to explain this. Okay, think if I was outside of a flat area and I wanted to build a house. Hi, Justin. Um, I start doing it by myself. And then your friends are like, whoa, you can't build no house. I think that's Angel coming on. Maybe. Hi, Angel. <laughs> hey, what's up, Justin? Just talking about hater friends. So, fly area. You're like, man, I gotta build this house. I just need to build a, a house. So you start building it. You've never built a house before. Um, and your friends are like, what are you doing? Why are you building a house? You've never built a house. This is stupid. You should just stop. What's the point? That is the way to not succeed. Uh, for one, that's a negativity. For two, you're not supporting your friend, which is super important. Uh, they're not going to be as... Hey, Clayton. That's why I stopped on you. Um, yeah, exactly. Angel, I get what you're saying. Um, I've, I've lost friends, Facebook friends. But here's the thing. The Facebook friends are going to fall off. And that's fine. I don't even care about that because 
if they don't support me in my entrepreneurship and trying to build an empire from the ground or a house, I don't need you. You know, if you're not going to support me, what the heck? Are, you're wasting my time. Why are you my friend? Why are you my friend? What's the point? What are you doing for him? Hey, Joe. Uh, if you can't, like, support somebody, then stop. Stop saying anything. Um, stay out of it. That's the main thing. Just stop. Why are you... Why, why negative? Just stop with the negativity. And... Um, starting starting a business is not easy nor is building a house from scratch that's why it was a decent example okay this business does not run without a person's effort okay that's how if you're trying to start something like build the house the house is the business, right? If you're trying to build this house, it's only going to get built if you build it. So you have to work like, you have to work super hard and just middle finger all the haters, get back to work, work hard, build that house and go live in it, and then your friends will be like, oh man, that house is so great, can I like, can I come over and check it out? No, you didn't support me. What good are you? If you're a friend, you would have cared about the process and not cared about the result as much. Because building this house is difficult, okay? It's taking up a lot more hours, but you know what? I know it's going to have an enormous payoff. So I'm going to keep trucking and doing my thing and just balls to the wall if you don't support me then stop stop don't care if you don't support me I don't because here's the thing if I've learned anything criticism means hey Carrie Criticism means you're becoming successful because people are starting to notice you. People are starting to be like, what is this guy doing? What's he think? And then all of a sudden, people that are working all their butt off and things become successful. It happens. It happens every day. Um, people quit their jobs and the people that they are working with that didn't support them, they get pushed off into nothing. You know, um... It's hard. It's hard. Morning, Carrie. Um, family and friends should support one another. Absolutely not hinder. Because there is no outcome that's going to be helpful to anybody. What's the point? So I did have a couple friends just delete me. Because they're probably tired of seeing my business stuff. And here's the thing. Hey, Hunter. I work through... Facebook, so Facebook is like my store, okay? It's like my house. So I have to get people in the house. You know what I mean? So I blow up Facebook because I believe in it. I feel super strong about it. I'm getting results from these new workouts. I mean, we're doing pretty, pretty good stuff, you know, so far. And I haven't even lost any fat yet. And I'm gaining some good old muscle mass at home. I believe in this stuff because I have it every day. I live it. I breathe it. Okay? And I'm truly passionate about it. And it's not some made up thing. If I message you and I sound monotone, that's because <laughs> I'm just monotone sometimes. And if I'm not, it's harder when I'm on a rant like this, I get more excited. But if, let's say I need to, I'm like, man, I really got to reach out to 30 more just 30 and then I start sending out and by 20 I'm starting to get like hey people you know I'm just starting to get monotone that's just 
that's just how it is, you know. It's not, it doesn't decrease my passion. It doesn't decrease how I feel inside, uh, what it's doing for my mind, um, the positivity it's bringing. You know, I have my negative moments, but up here, I'm really working hard. Because this business wants you to not just grow physically, but mentally, okay? They they say personal development is key in this business, and I've never been a book reader, ever. I've read one book in high school that I was forced to read, <laughs> and it was Slaughterhouse-Five. I don't even know what that is. I don't even remember, but that stuck with, my, with me. But I've finished three books. I've listened to one of them six times. Uh, I'm, uh, I listened to one almost two times, and then I got a new book, so now I'm on that. Roxanne, what's up? Uh, Matthew, hey. I haven't said hey to people in a few. It's a lot more active at this time of day. I don't ever get a weekend off, so I'm off on a weekday. Uh, support your friends, okay? If, they're, if your friend messages you, maybe you should open it and check it out. Because maybe they're throwing everything on the line because they want success. Think of that. I'm not some made-up person. I'm not trying to rip you off. I'm trying to change your life forever. I'm trying to change how you perceive the world. It sounds stupid, right? It sounds stupid. But it's so true because I'm living it right now. I'm doing it every day. This blows my mind. People are like, that sounds like a fairy tale. That sounds like, sounds made up. Sounds like you're trying to really sell a product. But you know what? Those words that I'm saying are super passionate and super true. Okay? And I have proof. People have grown so much. I'm going to put a post up later today because I want to. I just want to recognize this man that I really follow. Um, his name's Scotty Hobbs. Okay? I'll post about him later. Oh, please send me, um, please put a comment and let me know if you're here now or later. So I know if you watch this as a recording, because I'm just trying to get numbers figured out, trying to get stuff figured out. Um, so it helps. And please comment, like, and share. Uh, I know friends see this. Please comment, like, and share. Because the only way this works is if friends help to share, okay? Just share, I'll just talk like this till you share, okay, thanks. <laughs> but really, this is my store. I need the word out. So, Scotty Hobbs seven-figure earner. He's done this about eight years. Uh, he used to go to his friend's house to borrow their computer to start this. Uh, dude now lives, I don't know where he lives, but he's got, a, he stays somewhere where it's warm because he posts a workout every day of him working out outside. He's got all of his stuff outside because it must like never rain or something. He's probably on the west coast, but he has rental properties that he's, like that's his, it's like his secondary thing to uh, what I do, but it's gotten him to where he has rental properties and he's just still pulling in money, and he's pulling in over 20000 a week, a week, hi Nicole, uh, I can't say I idolize him. But I really look up to him because I feel like he is exactly what I want to be. Uh, he's so at peace with himself. He's got five kids because he has the money and the availability and he's not working to raise these kids. And they're all getting raised very well. You can tell they're loving life. Hey, Joe. Uh, that's what I want to be. You know, uh, the guy, he retired his his mom and dad bought them, now they do rental properties with them. 
Some guy was like, "Why? what is this guy doing just chilling on a porch? <laughs> that look was great. He was like, go buy a scar. <laughs> so, anyways, support your friends, okay? When a friend reaches out to you like me, we're Facebook friends, right? I've got over 2,000 of you. If I reach out to you, maybe you should check it out because I'm being a genuine person. And I want you to grow. And I see the potential. And you'll hear that. Will be a little monotone, probably. <laughs> but I love all of you, okay? I'm here to help you all. I want to. You guys just gotta listen and understand. So I'm just gonna keep showing up till. Who is on here? Hey, Anthony. Hey, hey Mike. I'll be seeing you soon. Um, so anyways, everyone have a great day. Uh, hey, Fred. And thank you, everyone, for checking this out. My gosh. This is awesome. I'm loving it. I love what I do. I really do. I've never, I never knew how much I would love this till I started. So... Anyways, I'm going to go talk to people and try to change their lives. Okay, you have a good one. I'll be back, uh, you know, tomorrow for a wake up with what, 20 or 27. And I got to think of something to talk about. So if you guys have any ideas, please comment below what you'd like. If you have any questions you want me to answer tomorrow, I'll be here. I'm here every day, no matter what. If I'm alive and waking up, I'm going to do Wake Up With Wyatt because that is what I said I would do. I'm going to show up every day, okay? Have a wonderful day. Leave me stuff in the comments. Please share my videos. Share my stuff. Go to my page. Just start clicking share, 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 share. Because the thing is, I could be... It could... Oh, man. You don't know what it could help to share, okay? And comment, please. Take care. Have a wonderful day. It's beautiful out. It's August. It's almost school time. <laughs> so enjoy today, okay? All right.